Well, isn't this pretty? I haven't even cleaned it up yet. Honda 3000 IS. The owner says it only runs when the choke is on, which is a, indicative of a clogged carburetor. But I'm getting jumpy. Come on. Is it me? Oh, it's full of gas. Let's have a look at it. I wonder if it's full of 10 year old gas. Uh -huh. No? Pretty new fuel. Let me get the screen out. It's got a few crab bunnies in it. Why won't that come out? Ah! Well, I guess we'll just leave it in there. That's just a few of the guys I got out of there. So in general, the fuel looks fair. I've got the choke pulled out. What have we got? Fuel valve. Its fuel is on. Where's the rope? Right here. Runs pretty good. There's a bit of tiny bit of surging on the carburetor. Not much. So I think just a bowl pull and a, a main jet clean might do it. What do you guys think? Oh, you, I can't hear you. And you know, the owner was so nice that he brought his own little dolly with him. Ah, there we go. Alright, I think this is the door where it's all happening. This is the starter over on this side. So let's, uh, let's what do we got in here? This is all just a mystery to me. Oh, this is where you check the oil. Okay. Well, I'm assuming it has oil because it started and didn't blow up. So let's just get a screwdriver. It's kind of intriguing, eh? I get a real charge out of these generators. Hmm, there it is right there. Get that bowl off of there without without uh, doing heart surgery. Gonna have a look at the air filter. Oh, it's perfect. This guy's doing the right thing, guys. So, ten, ten, and ten, right? In there. But I'd like to get the bowl off without. Hmm, it's pretty tight though, isn't it? Let's just take that air cover off of there so that we have room to maneuver. I wish I had a 90 degree... Well, I kind of do have a 90 degree guy. It's a 
pretty good size. That's going to work. That's kind of exciting, isn't it? Make sure that's a 10. Yes, it is. Okay. Are you guys right there looking at me? Ooh, we're getting some bad light from the door now. So let's go over here and do it this way. That should work. Okay, this is the holder on her. Hmm. I tell you, working on little generators, you got to have all of the dew hummers and who's it's right? This has got tape on it. it has me slightly concerned. Okay, there we go. That's a heavy thing. All right. Now this. Oh, this is just a choke. Watch this over here now. Come on to hit. Right. Let's pull a choke. See that? So that's not too bad. I think I can get that carburetor off, the carburetor bowl off without getting a hernia. Now what do I need? I need a uh, 10 millimeter ratchet wrench. Get that bowl off. Let's turn the fuel off. It's a nice, it's a nice unit you guys. Like really it is. This is going to spill a small amount of fuel. But I've got the fuel turned off. I'm going to look in the bowl first. Small amount of rust and accumulation. Let's go back to W. Wide. Okay. There's the bowl. Bit of dirt, right? Now, I've got a tool that can take that jet out of there without disrupting the world. So it's a straight shanked screwdriver with a very short with a flat handle. Can we get that in there? There it is. It's coming out. I can see the... There it is. Okay, the jet fell out. <laughs> now we gotta find the jet. I won't be able to pick that up with my magnet. There it is. 
Okay, it's, I can see a hole through it, but a very small one. I don't know if you guys can share this, I can share this with you or not. Yeah, you can, you can see through that, eh? It looks fair. So now, what do we do? I think I'm going to use uh, welding torch tips. I'm going to spray it with our spray it with card cleaner backwards the way it came in. Here we are. Doesn't really seem to really want to be a there. Now I'm going to blow some air through there. Clean it out. Doesn't look a lot different. Oh, it does. Okay. Now let's get the uh, emulsion tube out of there. Maybe it already fell out. Here it is. <laughs> that was fun. Now we're going to get the other tool that I got from Jim Yeski. Yeski Jeski. And this is just a emulsion picker holder cleaner upper. So it just took a little time. I got the emulsion tube clean all the way around. There it is. And I'm tempted to just go up a quarter of a size, or not even, on this jet. I don't know. Well, I think that's enough. Good. Now I'm going to try and put it back together again. I'm there. Now I gotta clean this bowl up. It's just got a bit of sponge in it, eh? Okay, now I'm going to put it back on. You guys getting a look at this? Yeah, kind of, eh? Good. Okay. Stuff on top, and that's 
I wonder if I can uh, just put some uh, shims on there, some little bushings, and just tighten it up with the nuts. Yeah, that might, some of the bushings are right here. I can push them out. Okay, I got the bushings out of the uh, air filter, so we'll just use those. Let's turn the gas on. The gas is over here. But I wouldn't mind venting a little bit of the fuel. Oh, rats. I have to remember that. Oop, that gasket right there. I think it goes behind the choke. It might not. It might go right on the air filter. So we're choking, we got to remember that gasket, which goes on the air filter. That's the breather. Choke's on. Fuel's on. Turn to on. And pull the rope. smooth but I haven't got the air filter on it yet. Sometimes this Honda stuff needs an air filter. I'm going to try a couple of go to heck moves here. Turn it on. Starter up. Alright you guys, I've had the camera on all along, but I've been looking for the spark plug and I finally found it. Or 13 sixteenths or something weird. 13 sixteenths, huh? I just want to check the plug to see how it's burning. Plugs can tell you a lot. Ooh. 
There we go. Pliers. NGK BPR 5ES. So my friends, I think we got it. Oh, I gotta put these spacers in here. These little package generators are sure hard to work on. Eh? It's not threading on properly. It's a fine thread. Excuse me again. I'll loosen these off a little bit so we have some slack. I'd use the air on this one, but it's easy to strip it out. I only like to use it to take stuff off. Filter. Filter cover. Good. All right. Now the big test. Choke. 